Hello Fridge Cam and welcome to another Sunday. Now there are tons of equipment in a kitchen that you can use to cook things with. Yeah, you can do hobs, yeah. uh, ovens, microwaves. Dishwashers? I think today might be a bit of an experiment. This could be interesting. So, like all good experiments, we're going to start easy with a three course meal. So for a starter, we're going to go for some eggs with asparagus dippers. So shall I get the uh, dishwasher tablet? Ready? I'm not sure we want to put any detergent in, but in theory, dishwasher salt is going to be seasoned water for our asparagus. I think that could work. Next up in our fish washer, it's a fish course. Here we have a poignant bed of samphire mixed with some split in half cherry tomatoes, a beautiful salmon fillet, topped off with some butter and of course seasoned to perfection, shoved into a Tupperware box, wrapped in cling film and ready to go in our dishwasher. If salmon fillet's not your thing, next up we have an entire rainbow trout stuffed with slices of lemon. That's going in. And to serve with our fish, we've got a nice fresh fragrant pea, mint, lemon zest, couscous, kill in a jar, that's going to go up there. Now I'm a meat man, so I've taken some pork chops and rubbed in some butter with cumin and ground coriander and placed it into the dishwasher. To serve with our pork, we've got a sweet potato mash. Very small, peeled and diced sweet potato. In theory, that's all going to cook in there and we can just squeeze it up into a smush. And for dessert, what could be better than a syrup steamed sponge? And to serve with our sponge, some gorgeous poached fruit, which we're going to poach in our own kind of mulled wines. That's red wine, cinnamon stick, vanilla, a bit of clementine peel, blueberries and plums. As long as it's airtight, in theory, I can lay it down. All it needs is to be set to uh, 70 degrees Celsius, 2 hours 25 minutes, start, go. Here he comes. So what have we been doing this week? Do you know what? We cooked something that looked a little bit alien on Tuesday. Uh, it was sweet and it was quite a difficult one, wasn't it? But it was, it was I, good. I enjoyed this one. It was good, wasn't it? It was very good. It was a mystery to us all. On Friday, we announced a new series of Big Night In. Yes! Oh, it's bigger and yes! better than ever before. It is going to be incredible. And why is it going to be incredible, James? Well, Jamie, you'll have to go and see the video to find out. We are link bait queens. Why am I even here? Uh, for comment of the week, I'm comment of the week. Oh yeah, I have a comment of the week. It's from our pull apart pizza video from Tristan. And um, this is where the guys were peeing all over the place. Up. Oh. Ping pong. Ah, oh, alliteration, an avocational ability, and an admirable addition at articulating the application at our <laughs> Wow. Awesome. I broke into a sweat trying to read that. <laughs> ben, cooks, can't read. It's pretty difficult to tell what's happened, really. I, mean, I can't see a thing. No. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get them all out and see if any of them are edible. Well, the majority have worked. A slim majority have worked. Five out of the nine I'm very happy with. Couscous is awesome. And both types of fish. Whole fish and our fillet of salmon. And now for my pork. I think it's worked. You would probably want to just sear it off in a pan to get some colour. With but some butter. Look at this. Cut into that. It's a little bit dry, if I'm honest. Mm -hmm. I think it's mm, cooked through, but it's quite dry. And look, our sweet potato mash is not very mashable. So look, our egg was starting to work. It's just not what I was aiming for. Asparagus. So the question is, what chemicals has it absorbed? I don't think this is one you should try at home. If you do want to try it, I would um, completely seal it from your dishwasher you, salt. You just ate it. You did it again. But it's perfectly cooked. And our poached fruit it's perfect. You've still got the alcohol there. It's not cooked off the alcohol. But that is really good. What I don't suggest you do though, steam sponge, because <laughs> that hasn't worked. <laughs> so in summary. Just don't bother. Come on, let's go back to the fridge. What are you doing? I'm taking the camera. Wow. Well, if that didn't blow your mind, then this will. We made a One Direction parody and it got played at the O2 before the actual gig on the massive screens. It was immense. And it's all part of this cool thing we're doing with YouTube right now. So if you want to know more about it, click on the blog we've linked down below and it explains everything. And if you're new around here, we don't just experiment with food all the time. We do actually test some recipes. So make sure you're subscribed so you get all of that. And do you know what? I actually think this fridge cam might have had everything. I think you might be right. It had steamy Ben's glasses. <laughs> it had a very tanned return of Mike from it Mexico. It did, and it had loads of this. 
Make sure that you join us next week, 10am UK time, on a Sunday, for more Fridge Cam fun. Until then, see ya. <laughs>